Oh, yep, yep. Yes, we're on. Peppa. <laughs> I'm not hungry and I haven't been catching that many fish. Let's go fishing, mate. Cab dogs hammock. Probably one of the best places I've camped. Hopefully we can catch a fish. I'm so hungry, man. I didn't get one for dinner, so I'm starving. Woo! Boy. Oh, oh mate. Why can't I catch a fish in Indonesia? Just want some food. When I, when I want to fish for food, I can't catch it. <sighs> oh, I'm going to stand on the magic rock. Please, can we have a fish to eat? Nothing. Uh, just put this little short jig on. Whippy, whippy! Whippy, whippy! Whippy whip! Whippy whippy! Yeah! Sick! Mate, well, Cab Dog isn't really having a very good time here. I'll tell you what, Indonesia is very hard to catch a fish from the shore. I, don't know, I could just be very unlucky, but first cut. Is that a fish? No. No fish. First cast cabby, I ain't getting any fish on the first cast, that's for sure. I'm actually might starve here, it's really psycho. I thought because of how remote I am, there's gonna be so many fish. Tidak banyaki khan, man, tidak. So I'm gonna wait until this tide goes out a bit more and then swim out to here. Not frothing, eh? Cab dog's not frothing for once. All right, do you think the fishing sucks here because I brought rotten bananas? Or because of these boats that constantly come past? That's one big boat towing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Even if you go the remotest place in Indonesia, there's just fishing everywhere. Go on bananas, mate, go on bananas. At least I've got a nice camp. <laughs> That's probably the best thing about this trip. Uh, I'm gonna try and eat more bananas, I guess, before they go rotten. Yeah. Three more days, two more nights. This is my second last one. Just a big thing of jelly. So many bluefin. Let's go smaller lure. Little trevally thing. Oh, can things get any worse? Man, I saw a bluefin and it didn't hit. What? Yep, yep, yes, we're on. What have we got? I don't really care what we have because I'm gonna eat it. There's heaps of them. Heaps of them. What is this? Oh, what? I don't know what that is. It's like a little queenie or something. Put it in a rock pool, I'm getting straight back down there. Got some food. Look at that thing. Get the hook out. Super slimy. There he is. What do you call that thing? I'm gonna get back down. It's maybe it's some sort of a mackerel. I'll kill him. Oh, I'll put him in the rock pool. Stay in there, mate. Oh, I need to kill it. I'll just do it now quickly. But this is this is food for me. 
just biked me. It's the craziest thing, man. All right, it's really small, but I need food. I need anything. Eat whatever I can catch. Let's get back down there, there might be more. Oh, that hurts so much. Totally got me. All right, the fishing has been so hard. I've gone to a plastic. First time in ages. If I can't catch a fish on this, I quit. <laughs> Into the Jew hole. Wow. Wow. Oh, he just got red bast. What? No way, I finally got a fish. I'm in the reef. No way. Let's sashimi this up. No scales on this thing, which is cool. I'm so hungry, dude. Absolutely frothing on this. I don't want any waste. I'm that hungry. Oh, nice. That looks cool. Uh, I'm going to use this to skin. Because, yeah, like I said, I don't want any waste. I'm going to eat everything. And this is flat. Is it flat? It's not that good, actually. Maybe the ground is better. Oy. Yes. Perfect. There's a first fillet. Alright, second side. Hopefully I can do it as good as the last one. That was pretty much perfect. Perfect, brah. I'm going to chop it up. into little sashimi bites it's actually a small fish but this is gonna save me from going hungry some nice sh sashimi pieces i'm gonna solder up i need some salt for hydration a little bit of salt is good for hydration pepper so it's breathed in so much pepper. Here's the lime. Put it on, bruh. Oh, ha, ha. I'm so frothy on this. There it is, my plate of sashimi. I'll dig in right now. Oh. As you can see, it's a million degrees here. Phew. It's a sashimi fish, mate. Alright, I'm gonna finish this off. Try and get another one. I'm not hungry. And I haven't been catching that many fish. Here we go. Is every fish good sashimi? <laughs> it seems like every fish I have is so much better raw. Wow. I'm not going to lie, the fishing has been very difficult. I just got smoked by a red bass just here. I saw it come up, eat the plastic on the ultralights out straight into a hole. 
couldn't get it out. But I wouldn't have eaten that anyway. Red bass, pretty toxic in most places. Maybe not everywhere, but in, in a lot of places. This is seriously fishing for survival, man. I've got like a couple of packets of dry noodles left. And that's it. <laughs> and a little bit of water. This is actually my breakfast. <laughs> Just trying to catch anything actually to eat. Here we go. So good. Yes! Oh, it's a Roy! Can you eat that fish? I'd probably try and eat it anyway, I'm so hungry. Oh, wow, look at the fin colour. That's so beautiful. I'm gonna put him in the rock pool. the same thing but bigger a bigger Roy what oh, I swallowed this one I don't even think I can get that out its teeth are crazy another Roy this one's slightly bigger I need to try and get this hook out that is really really crazy I just went to get pliers to get that soft plastic out this that was so stuck in the tongue of this Roy and I just got back and it was out so I don't know but you know how people say if you lose a fish a lure is in its mouth it's stuck with that forever well apparently not because that was so in there I could not get it out <sighs> Whoa, he what He's going crazy, he's trying to bite me. I just got two of these things, two Roy. Oh, this is more fresh water. I need to decide which one to eat. Oh, it's like a love heart. It's a full on love heart. Oh, there's one Roy. Get back in there. There's the other one. I got my own little fish pond here. Well, I've got a bit of decision to make. Which Roy do I keep? Do I keep both? Probably not because it's so hot here. I won't be, I don't have anywhere to store it and I don't need to eat two fish. So do I keep the, the big one? Or do I keep the small one? So what I'm hoping is, I'm hoping the big one has already spawned before. I'm thinking of letting the small one go. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. So I'm gonna eat the big one. Man, the colors are crazy on the big one right now. That's amazing. Oh, they're just swimming around me now. They're like my pets. I'm going to let the baby one go now. I'll let you go, bro. Oh, there's a fish just there. Colourful one. Right. Be free, bro. Ew. All right, and sadly for the big one, your food, mate. I'm super hungry. I need anything I can catch. Sorry, mate. But yeah, your dinner. So breaking its neck, I reckon is the best way to kill these fish. No colour. Colour. 
That's actually crazy. Oh, there we are. Oh, its teeth are so sharp. Oh, we're gonna head back. I've actually, I've never eaten a Roy, but it's supposed to be actually really good. Oh, time's coming in. This could be pretty psycho. Oh. Oh. Uh -oh. oh. Jesus. We made it. Woo. All right, let's go make a fire, all right? Take all this wood. It's not very good stuff, but it'll have to do. All right, this is where I'm going to do it, right here. There's more wood here too. But first I've got to do a fire pit. Just move this one around a bit. Ugh. This fella. Ooh. That's it. The fire pit. Eww. Collect all the wood and put it here, then we'll start the fire. There's a bit of wood. I'll get some starter stuff. That was pretty easy. <laughs> well, there's some more starter. All right, well, the sun's going down. I want to get this fish cooked as soon as possible. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna stake this guy onto a stick and then we we'll eat him. Oh, I need to make a bit of a a bit of a stake here. Super hot. Oh! This is how I'm gonna cook it. I'm just gonna put it on the hot coals. So I'm just gonna cook the Roy like this on the hot coals. Indo style, mate. This is how they do it in Indonesia. Just straight on the fire. I'll get a little bit more. Oh, there's heaps of coals there. I can hear the fish cooking. Push some of these coals under. Maybe I should flip him. Yeah, that's hot still. <laughs> that was crazy. Give it a little bit of smoky, smoky flavor right now, eh? Smoked fish, mate. Froth it. Oh, smoky, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna put it on its belly. 
Oh yeah, whoa, look at that. Ah, nice, there's still plenty of coals. So frothing on this, I've never had one before. It's supposed to taste really good. All right, so the fish is ready, we're gonna take it off the fire. Whoa, yes. Oh, it looks perfect. It's sort of on the edge of a cliff. <laughs> Bit crazy. But it smells really good. I'm gonna eat it like this. Oh my god, look at that. Wow. Boy. Is this my new favourite fish? It tastes like crab and fish put together. That's really psycho. And the skin is epic. My favourite. There we go. Just show you what sort of meat it looks like. Well, I'm going to finish this off, I'm going to flavour it up, and then eat it. <laughs> but this is my first ever Roy, or they call it a peacock roper. In Hawaii they say this is an invasive species. I think they just kill them, I don't even know if they eat them. But in many other places they eat them and they're highly regarded. Yeah, I'm eating it, I'm in Indonesia, I'm going to eat it. It tastes really good. It's frothing. Right, flavour time. Plenty of lime. Some meagering oil. Right, the sun's just gone down. It's gonna get really dark in a minute, so I'm gonna end the video here. I've actually got a bluefin tuna that I just caught before. And I'm gonna sashimi that up because I'm I'll definitely get hungry again later. I haven't been eating much. Cow dog's getting skinny mate. See you next video, it will probably be the bluefin sashimi for a midnight snack. Alright, see you guys, I'm going crazy!